Okay, so we got it out of the packaging and it looks so, so good. This was who I joined the group order for from. This is the same person I bought from her auction last, uh, last haul and I have had a super good experience with her. Now that Balencia Group um, dot shop is moving, I believe, to China, um, I don't know if she's going to still do the same kind of group orders and she's in, um, it's going to be probably more difficult if anything. So this is like the packaging for it. This is insane. Oh, and this is all the songs. Anyway, I'm probably going to join more of Courtney. Um, that's her name, Courtney's group orders for sure. If she has any for like lucky draws and the like. So this is the cover. Now let's go ahead and see what's inside. Whoa. Whoa. So this is super nice. This is just all the prettiest like peach color. Really like that. And these are, I believe, yeah, these are stickers. So you get two different versions. This is the the purple version. And then the camper van version basically, but don't know another way to say it so very nice won't use them but it's nice to have and this is the little little pamphlet of little information and stuff and now the photo book oh if i could see the cards oh, okay here are the cds very nice very nice this is impressive i'm really glad i joined this joined this because you needed to be a part of the japan fan club which I'm not, so this is very nice to join. And I think at the front, dun, 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 we have the photo cards. Yay! Oh my goodness. So I ended up getting Tay for the photo cards on this. And this is like a, yeah, they're kind of like clear on the back, but they are nice pictures, which I like a lot. I feel like they both look really good. This is from like the, the best version, and this is, I believe, DNA, Mic Drop, Crystal Snow or something like that. Crystal Snow is probably my favorite Japan song of all time. I'm obsessed with it. So, got these. And this is actually a nice, because it's not as obviously clear compared to this one. Because the background's darker. But, anyway. Got the photo cards here. And now let's go ahead. I'm trying to think the best way to do it. Ooh. Wow. I just wanted to see like how was it inside. So first you get here. Very nice picture with all the different songs. And then of course it ends with Crystal Snow. This is the group picture. Love it. Wow, it has all the lyrics. This is so fancy. And it's like a compilation album got dynamite make it right Ooh, Japanese version nice speaking of make it right it's been made clear that Ed Sheeran was um, not was is gonna be a part of the other song that's being released with the butter CD um, permission to dance and I can't wait to hear it because make it right is one of my favorite songs so we've got the Recent photo shoot styling, very nice. This is like really high quality. This was a legit, I'm probably gonna keep this in the plastic cause I feel like I need to because it's so well like designed. I don't even wanna like bend the pages that much cause I feel like it's so fancy. They look so good in this photo shoot. They're just chilling, they're on a road trip. Oh, and then we get the purple. Nice, so you get both of, um, you get ex um, exposure to both different uh, concepts and designs. Yeah, this was totally worth it. If there's still group orders out there and you're interested in the Japan Fan Club, uh, the Japan Fan Club version, it's huge. I mean, obviously, it's not even fitting properly in the whole frame, but definitely worth your while if you're interested in all the different albums as much as like I am. Oh, and 
And then we get Mago Soul. Oh, okay, so these are the past. This is Blood, Sweat, and Tears, right? 2017. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Wow. Four years ago, and they still, they look so grown up now. Four years later. I like this styling a lot, too. The very um, preppy styling of, yeah, Mic Drop DNA Crystal Snow. Which is this photo card. So you can see here, it's got the same jacket. Then we get into Face Yourself, right? Yes. Wow, I'm getting good at this. I really don't keep up with the Japanese releases as much. Um, but I'm getting the hang of it. I enjoy this. This is like a look back at everything. Is that idol? Looks like idol, right? Yeah. This is lights. Yes, lights and boy with love. I see a lot of um and collector videos about like the like posters I guess that got released and stuff. So that's how I remember the names. And then this one I remember because it was all black and white. And then they had the colorful. I don't know why I don't care for the styling. Uh, uh, really, the I think it's the blue, like, it's almost like a drawing on the photo cards. So, I was never really interested in picking them up. I've seen them a lot on Baiyi. That's why I'm thinking of them. Now. I love this. This is the prettiest color. And I really like this design, though, where they're just, like, on a road trip. It's like they're on a road trip looking back, right? <laughs> Anyway, so that is that for this. I'm going to go ahead and put this back where it was. I want to just keep it all secure. I'll probably keep this. Where is it? Right here. So yeah, everything arrived in perfect condition. It arrived super fast. I did not think it would come that fast in the mail, but it did. And yeah, I've had a great experience with, um, with this group order and group order manager. So definitely going to look out for whenever the next releases come out I will definitely join the group order so that is the first pickup for the month hey everyone welcome back to my channel so for today's video I'm going to be doing my monthly Neokio unboxing I am not making as much progress as last month in terms of my uh BTS like album uh photo card collection but I did pick up some really exciting stuff so I'm really excited to open these now. Recent goods. Just came in price tour. This is like a little advertisement. So let's go ahead and just I'm gonna open these up and like flip them around. Ooh, let me open the big ones first. So on Neokyo I ended up finding some really good deals for Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing my monthly Neokyo unboxing and this one I'm super, super excited about. I'm not making like entirely uh, sole progress on my BTS album photo card collection. I did pick up some really, really exciting items, so I can't wait to, can't wait to unbox them now. I already opened all the packaging from Neokyo, so this is not how they arrived. They arrived secure and in good condition, so... Where do I start? Do I do these first? No, let's do the big one here. So, dun -dun -dun. I ended up picking up the high postcard set as well as, oh, I shouldn't have put it away. Let me get my little trusty opener. I ended up picking the Hive uh, Insight photo cards and postcard set, which I did not plan to do, I actually did buy some of the Hive photo cards individually, I think I got like three of them, like, I think I got Yoongi, Namjoon, and Tae, because I liked, especially Namjoon's, I really liked his uh, photo card, so I'm going to end up having some dupes there that I'll have to eventually sell off, because I was seeing these go just for like ridiculous amounts of money, and I figured, you know, like, I'll just get a couple of the photo cards just to have them because they look so pretty, but for like such a good deal I ended up finding this entire 
unopened set. I'm so excited. So, let's also open up is the sticker outside. Let's see. Oh, what's the best way to do this? I don't want to accidentally nick something. Including myself. I don't want to accidentally nick myself. Okay, I think I got it. There we go. So let's go ahead and see how these look in person. I'm so excited. I did not think they would go for... I guess that's one thing I need to remember is be patient with some of the new release stuff. When it comes to non-album things, I'm not like super dedicated to collecting them at all, but with... Okay, so the stickers are on the back, so... I'll just keep it, whatever, I'll put it here. Um, so, it was well worth the wait to end up getting a really good deal on these. So, there we go. We believe in music. I apologize for my nails, I cannot get this dang nail polish off. It's really strong. So, this is how the front looks. Okay. Oh my gosh, I love it, it's like a little book. So first we have Namjoon's card. I'm gonna try not to open them too big. Well, then again, I might store them in my, yeah, I might store them in my binder. Oh my gosh. These are so beautiful. And this is why I was interested in them because I felt like it was just such a pretty photo, like photo shoot. I think these are these are pretty much the same as the photo cards, no? Could be remembering wrong. This is how the back looks, by the way. People, I might just keep this little book for now. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Look at how! Oh my gosh, they look so good. It's like a mini little like photo shoot, like fashion magazine. These are so nice. Wow, I didn't think it would be like this in like this little booklet. So pretty. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I got this for such a good deal. Miyoki is awesome. It's not awesome for my wallet, but it's awesome for serotonin. So next up is the photo cards. So let me very carefully open up the plastic. I actually have my dog like right next to me here. He's listening to me unbox my Neo Kyo haul. There we go. So the little plastic bits here that I need to keep with the trash pile. So next we have the photo cards. It's completely brand new. I can't believe people were selling this. I'm so happy I found it. I think all I did was I looked at BTS Hive or BTS Insight and it ended up coming up. And of course there were others who were selling them for more, so I, I luckily found a good deal. I think this was maybe 25 maybe? It's a little sticker. So this is like a little cassette kind of holder. Ooh, okay. Look at that. So this is like a little display. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, how do I do this? Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and close that up. Did I close it? Yeah. Wow, this is so legit. I wish they did something like this here. It must be so fun to see all the cool merch and everything. So, first here we've got Namjoon. Jin, Yoongi, Phoebe, Jin, Tay. Ooh, I didn't even look at the backs. Oh my goodness, this is such a nice photo card back. How pretty. Where was I? Tay, and then JK, and then again. Oh my goodness, I can't believe I own these. It looks so good. Oh my goodness, and that's the whole set. So again, on the back and then up there, it has their name. 
Wow, what a great start to this haul. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm gonna put these for now here so you can kind of see them. Next up, let's grab from here. So first we've got the Love Yourself Answer Cards. And like I mentioned, I didn't make a whole ton of progress on my collection because I did buy some other like random bits and I knew that it was gonna be a big haul so I didn't wanna, <laughs> sometimes the photo cards, especially ones that I'm missing right now for some of the Love Yourself sets are gonna be pricey. So I didn't wanna spend too, too much because I knew I was spending on other stuff. Dun, dun, dun. We've got Hobie. This is Hobie's Love Yourself Answer version, I think, E? I think it's version E. Photo card. So this is taped here, so let me just take it off so I can get it out of the... If you hear something in the background, that is the vacuum. Hopefully it's not too loud. I also have the fan going, so... There's some background noise in today's video, which is totally fine. I did hear, I was, when I first recorded with the fan in the background, because it's so hot, because it's summer, of course, um, I was thinking, ooh, is it going to be super loud? But no, you could hear me fine. So, hopefully that's the same right now. So here we've got Love Yourself Answer version E, I believe, of Hobies. Yay! Okay, I did stop for a second, because the vacuum I knew was coming near <laughs> near right outside my bedroom so next next we have oh my goodness i can't wait to complete this set i only need jk's card i got love yourself answer version l taste card so this was i think the set that i'm second closest to finishing the first one i finished was love yourself answer version f of the answer sets and i'm happy i did that one first because since it's so popular, better to get it out of the way, right? So, next we have the holographic back and then taste card. I love this. I think this might be my favorite set besides F. I think it's super preppy and cute. So, cute photo shoot. And another take card. This might be the cheapest um, card I've seen his go for on Neokio. This is his version. Same as Hobie's version. I think it's E. And, oop, that was way too close to the card. We get... Just need to get through this. Because it's hard to see where the clear plastic ends. I feel like I'm not hitting it. Maybe I am. Let me just rip it like that. No? Okay. Uh... A little too close. A little too close for comfort to ripping the card. Let's see here. Yeah, I think I got this card for maybe ten dollars, which is for Tay's card cheap because his usually go for more. As you saw in my haul last month. So here we've got the orange background kind of design here perfect okay another break i did put on a ring because i was looking at these that this one and another one that i just bought it is off of etsy and it's a wandavision themed set one is vision and one is wanda so if you didn't notice the ring before it's there so next up it's gonna be one of the set that I'm collecting OT7 for for Muster. It is the number one out of eight. And this one is Yugi's. Oh my goodness. So cute. So I like this set the most because of the holographic light line here and I thought the message in the back was cool. And then here you can see, <coughs> excuse me, here you can see the date of uh, Muster. You can see the name of it and his name. So I thought it was a cute set to collect. Oh, no way. Perfect. Oh, and it actually, does it have the, oh, perfect. It has the one of eight here. I didn't know it did that. It did include it. Let me get some water. <coughs> My voice is cracking. 
So next up is another one. Beautiful. So these are all just like in the bare packaging because that's um, done by Neokio when they're like storing them. It's not like the actual cards are like delivered to the warehouse like that, but it's kind of how it works. So here we've got. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh, Namjoon's! Oh my goodness, I'm making such great progress. I think I only need JK. I think I only need JK actually because I already have Jin and Tay. And in this set, I think I'm getting the whole wrap line. I'm pretty sure this is Hobie. Yep, it's Hobie. And then I got Jimin. I, I bought it on Instagram. Yeah, I only need JK, which is awesome. I actually joined a group order for Jin and JK sets from the deluxe, like, what is it called? The, the one where you got like 10 sets of photo cards. And I'm waiting out on JK because there's a chance that in the set they might have this one. I think it does include it, so I'm just going to wait on that, and I'm also going to get a couple of JK and Jin cards. Hopefully I don't get too many dupes. If so, maybe I'll trade them. We'll see. So next, how am I just selling? Got J-Hope. Perfect. I love this set so much. I might just do this with every, like, event where they sell, like, the big uh, mini PCs in like eight different versions. I might find one that I like to collect. Kind of how like kind of how like people do it twice. So there you go. Ooh, what's this one? Oh my gosh! I didn't. I forgot I got Namjoon's one. This is the ticket kind of card. Oh, Cause I was thinking about collecting this one too when I bought it, but I might not. We'll see. We'll see. But now I have Namjoon, which is nice. And it's not like special special. It's not like a rare card or something. It's the uh, just a different version besides the... Or is it included in the 8? I don't know, but it's one of the versions. And this one's also really cool because of the back. Can you tell I like, like these backs where they look really neat? Look at that. That's so cool. Oh my gosh. And then it's just him in the front with the ticket. Shoot, I really like this set. As muster, like, as time passes since it occurred, before anything else, like, memories comes out, hopefully I can get some more. <gasps> I did not realize how much I love the back. And, of course, the front. So there's that card. I got a lot of the big size cards today, which is exciting. And now I've... <gasps> oh my goodness, hold on. Let's open this one first. <gasps> We've got my final card I needed for the winter package. Oh my goodness. I completed the winter package, everyone. I completed it. Let me very carefully open this. This is kind of crooked a bit, so I don't want to. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, shoot. Uh, oh, there's a sleeve. There we go. Dun, dun, dun. Look, it's Jimin's winter package card. <gasps> Look at his hair. That's a nice hair color. <gasps> and just like that, I'm done. Uh, this might be my favorite set. There, I have a couple, but this winter package set, I love it. I love the double-sided. And I love, like, the styling of it, I guess. Very wintry. Uh, where did I put him? It's here. You might need to put these cards like this just to get a little more space. Next up, we've got a Love Yourself tier card. And it's Hobie's sleeping one. This might be, I think, only this. Uh, Yoongi. I think that's all I've bought in. I pulled Namjoon when I got my album, so. I have made a lot of progress on this set. I think mainly my focus has been on the Sunset one. And the ones that I finished from tier is the denim jacket version, so I haven't made a lot of progress on this one. But slowly but surely I'll get there. If you couldn't tell, I'm pretty nonchalant about finishing it by a certain deadline. Just because I got in so late, 
uh, to the fan, like the fan base. So we've got, I love these cards so, so much. That's why I think I've been naturally drawn to finishing them. Plus it's the first album release where they have a version per, like four versions per album, more photo cards basically. So, oh my goodness. Uh-oh. I think I messed up. <gasps> no way. Oh, it does, it does. <laughs> so these are the Be Lucky Draw. Let me open this. The name tag. Be Lucky Draw um, hollow versions that were released with the Japan Fan Club draw. I have, these have the, been the longest in the warehouse. I think these were there for the total 45 days because I was stubborn, I did not want to pay more than like $25, $30 for each card because I knew I could get them for a good price. I knew I could find some good deals. So I ended up getting, look at the stars. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I love, love these cards. If they weren't so expensive, I seriously would pick up more. That reminds me, I might look up because I feel like a couple of like maybe Namjoon or Hobie might be selling for less which pricing's pricing crazy everyone knows that so i might pick some up add them to my collection here i did get namjoon though i think i think i got namjoon and jimin for those i'm not sure so for this one i thought for a second uh oh did i buy the regular version because i already own the regular version i did pull it in the lucky draw albums that i inadvertently bought from coco dive in the pre-order and nope, I did get the right one. I figured I had to, I mean, how could I miss it? Cause the seller took a picture like with the hearts on it, it was just hard to see in the packaging. So you can see here, we've got the group photo and they're pretty similar to the group photos that they released in the regular version, but I feel like just the haul, it makes, for me it was worth it. And I bought, I bought them for good deals, so. Yeah, I think the final photo card is this map of the soul of Namjoon. So this is version two. I did complete version one. So I'm making progress this month, but I'm not completing. Oh, it's not tape. I'm making progress, but I'm not completing any version besides the winter package, which is awesome. I love the winter package one. So I'm very happy to get, get those done. So this is a nice weave. I like that. This is version two. So now for version two, I think I only need, I think I only need the rest of the Hyung line actually. Yeah, Jin and, oh no, 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 I have Yoongi. I need Jin and J-Hope. I need Jin and Hobi. so. There's that. And then next are gonna be some additional things that I bought that aren't photo cards. So let's get into this. First up, dun dun dun. Oh, I did get a photo card. I got two more photo cards. That's such a lie. Why did I think I get I got more postcard? I guess because of the high insight. But anyway, this I found for like maybe six, maybe six dollars or seven dollars on Neokio. I was just looking at BTS photo, uh, BTS postcards because of my recent um, reorganization and getting a binder with sleeves that can fit the postcards perfectly, as well as postcards being a little more cheaper. I just got really, really obsessed with looking. So I found this for a good price and I love the concept styling because it's from Love Yourself Her. So let's go ahead and open it. Oh, I can feel a bit. Let me just slide it out. I can feel it a bit with the tape. So this is just like a regular postcard. I don't know if it was like from one of those, what is it called, like those exhibitions or something, but like at a museum or like a pop-up store or something. I'm not sure where this is from, but it's super, super cute, great quality, and I just wanted to add it because I do love OT7 pictures very, very much. It makes my life so much easier as an OT7 overall fan of like the cards and stuff when it's all of them in one place, in one picture, and they look so good. I love the styling. So this is, ooh, huge photo card updates. 
especially this one. I did end up picking up a Young Forever Memories of 2016 card, and now that I've got the Memories of 2016 DVD itself, it's kind of like I have like a proper set. Does that make sense? Like I got it with the photo card, even though I bought them separately. So this, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Put that here. This is the sunset version of Young Forever where they're just running off into the sun. Oh my gosh, I love the styling. I just, I'm obsessed with these Memory of 2016 cards. This would be, now that I'm, I'm done with like some of the other big purchases besides Magic Shop, as just a fan of this entire time, I would love to get some more Young Forever, uh, some more Memories of 2016 cards. Then the other one I want is the Young Forever where they're like in the parachute kind of photo shoot and I want to get the fire one. So I can't believe I own it. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Last but certainly not, certainly not least, I've got J-Hope's 5th Muster DVD photo card. Oh, I went through a huge like obsession with looking up the magic shop stuff and I couldn't find a good one on even Hobie literally none of them were they were just so freaking expensive until finally one day when I was not planning on buying anything so this was an out of discipline <laughs> but well worth it uh, purchase I found his car for such a good deal oh my goodness look at the back and this is such a cute card. I love the, the backs of the fifth muster. And fifth muster was the first muster I saw like, like the whole concert through pretty much on DVD or on video, I should say. So I love it. So I'll put him next to this card. And that is it. This was such a good, let me put the hive here to the side so you can see it. This was such a good haul. Oh my gosh. I don't think next month's Neokyo will be much of the size because I've been buying more um, for the butter release, but oh, these are so, I'm so excited to put these away. These are such beautiful cards. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give this video a like and to subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, everyone. So two super exciting packages arrived in the mail today, and this first one is one that I've been so determined to get. I unfortunately did not get it in the price range that I wanted it, but it's okay because I know it's only gonna it's only gonna get more expensive. And my tripod just fell, so I had already filmed my opening of the letter. But anyway, we have oh my gosh, we have my final memories of 2019 card that I needed, and it was Tay's, the most expensive card. I did pull J.K. in my DVD though, so I got lucky there. And really, if I hadn't pulled his, I probably just pulled. I mean, bought like the maybe two or three other cards just to have like a full four page of the of the photo cards because they were so pretty I probably wouldn't have collected every member but I did participate in like an auction kind of setup on these I think it was just mango tv bids but their instagram like individual account is mango tay sales so let's go ahead and get this out of the packaging Oh, let me take a quick picture though. I think I can take it with my phone. Yeah, you can click the little button. So let's go ahead and open this really quickly. I'm so excited. Wow, I can't believe, I've been really just back and forth so much with getting this card and I finally took the plunge and I won the auction, which was exciting. Auctions are, they're also dangerous though because everyone's betting so much. There were some other cards they, sold, they were selling that were definitely on my radar, but the price points were just going way too high. So I ended up getting just this card, which was expensive alone. But it's in perfect condition, which I noticed like right away from the video. They put a video as well so you could see like, oh, this is, it's in perfect condition. Yay! So memories of 2019. Is officially done and I think I know what this one is which is new and something I never thought I would participate in but I ended up getting a Macari account and the reason why was because I was looking for the I saw it in 
Jane uh, from Golden JJK. I saw it in her like favorite photo cards and like part of her collection video. This group picture from Map of the Soul Persona where I think it was like in a broadcast gift. So I was looking at broadcast stuff on Macari and like there were some selling for like a year ago. So cheap. But anyway, they didn't have the group card, but I did find this one that was such a good deal from this seller, Down With Love. And it is my first broadcast card set. I never ever thought I would get into broadcast cards, but because of my new photo card organization and getting like a setup where I can very easily organize postcards and because those are usually typically cheaper than photo cards, I've been really interested in picking up some to add to my collection. I think I need to open this. Uh, I gotta be careful. Right? I just need to open it a little more. So anyway, when I was looking at broadcast that broadcast gift, this ended up showing up and it was for way cheaper than I've seen on Macari uh, Japan through Buy Your Neo It was way cheaper. So I thought it's a reliable seller. This doesn't seem like a gimmick. They look real in the pictures. So let me go ahead and get it. I ended up buying it. I can't believe I have these. I'm so excited to put them away. Just gotta be a little more. I'm super careful with this stuff, but uh, I don't want to bend it. A little too careful because you gotta gotta really rip in the plastic, which is good because it's good uh, mailing material condition. There we go. So I think you can just slide them on out. Dun dun dun. Oh my goodness, my first set of broadcast cards, they're much smaller than I thought they would be, oh my gosh, but they're so pretty, wow, it's like a, it's just like a nice premium kind of postcard material, but I got the, I guess, light and dark version of Boy With Love, and the, um, the group photos is what interested me the most because, as you know, I love OT7 pictures in general and with the broadcast cards, it'd be hard, very hard to collect OT7 for. So I'm going to try my best going forward to get, you know, a couple here and there to my collection. But these were these were a more popular and more reasonably priced set to begin with and even a better deal when I bought from the seller Macari. So I had to I had to take the plunge. They came in perfect condition. So with Macari, you do have to rate the seller before they can get the money from the purchase. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that very quickly because it arrived really swiftly. I think it got delayed a couple of days with USPS, but it got here in great condition and I'm so excited. So those are my, it's pretty, it's a pretty uh, expensive little haul here with these three, but adding to my and finishing up my Memories of 2019 collection and getting my first broadcast cards is so exciting. I don't know what video, I'll probably do this in my monthly haul video. I won't do a separate one, but maybe I will. I don't know. Oh no, it's only six minutes. I thought I was talking more, but anyway, I love these. I love these cards so much. And it's from the same like era too. So today was all about Map of the Soul Persona. So I got a very exciting package in the mail today. I took play part, I took part in an auction been a long morning already and I had an idea of things to look at but with auctions it's just the price that things are going for like people were auctioning off was so high I didn't end up picking up that that much this was the only thing I picked up really actually so I didn't pick up much at all and this one has been on my radar for a while I think I've mentioned it in recent videos but I ended up winning the auction of Oh my gosh, one of the butterfly dream uh, pictures with mostly OT7. I did barely buy like a second miss out on the one of them in the pool that includes Jin. Jin's not in this picture. I think he's taking the picture, so he's kind of in it still. But anyway, this is, um, I'm going to take a quick picture for proof that it's all arrived 
safe and sound. Okay, I accidentally stopped recording, but I just took the picture really quick, so let's go ahead and get it out of its packaging. It arrived um, very well packaged, and I'm so excited to look at the freebies too. I feel like they look so cute. So, I do not plan on buying a bunch of Butterfly Dream cards anytime soon, but with um, just it being probably my favorite era of theirs, and with the group ones compared to, I think it was JK's and Yoongi's, um, going for so much, it was the best deal I was probably going to be able to get on these. Even though I've been looking on Yokio, and the only card I found is this one that I already have. I haven't found the pool one just yet, so I hope I could find it fairly soon. Fairly soon. So how do I get this out? I'm scared to... I don't want to cut the card. So I'm going to do this very carefully. Let's see. If I could just slice through with my thumb. Yes. Okay, perfect. So yeah, Butterfly Dream, just the design, I mean design, just the styling of it, I absolutely love so, so much, so I was very excited to end up getting this card is it a card? like a postcard kind of thing, I guess uh, kind of sticky I guess from the heat uh, let's see, let's see I'm trying to push it, there we go Oh, nope. Thought I got it. Okay, there we go. And it is in plastic, so it's not an issue. Um, anything that's... You hear the stickiness, it's not the actual card. So, let's go ahead and get it out. Wow, and you can, apparently you can tell from the numbers here whether it's fake or not. So, yeah, this is how the back looks. And this is the front. Oh my gosh, they look so young. Literally so young. I love it. I love the styling so, so much. And I just love the era in general um, from them. So, very happy to own this. So, quick look at the freebies. These are, I think, all pictures from, yeah, Blood, Sweat, and Tears. It's like the Memories um, 2016 card, this one, huh? This is another Memories 2016 card. Very cute. And then this is like a nice little... Lots of goodies in this one. Let's see what's in here. So cute. I usually... Actually, all the time, I very, very rarely do I get freebies with the things that I buy. Um, and I mainly buy through... Makari Japan via Niyoki or Bai, and it's just fun to see little freebies, so if I have some of these, sweet treats, how cute, there's little stickers, Jimin, and there's Yingi and Namjoon, oh this is cool, it's a little BTS logo sticker, and then Sate, no Jin, and cute little doggies. And then the Love Yourself heart, very cute, very cute. How neat! These are so nice. Oh my gosh, they feel like really nice for unofficial, like a photo card style. Jimin. These are super pretty. And Tay. Wow. These are so cute. Oh my gosh. It's Jimin. That is. Look at him. He's so little. He's so little. Oh, how neat. This is probably the thank you for purchasing, right? Oh my gosh. I got a little notepad. No way. That is it's like not that many, but still like a like a stationary item. How cute. 
Thanks so much for joining our auction. I hope this arrives safely and that you like the freebies. I love the freebies so, so much. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I'm totally gonna, totally gonna tag, her, tag them right now. And I did buy from Steph and this is their at. Oh my goodness, what a great little pickup. And it's been such a long day. I'm working from home today. I am very happy to have gotten this today. Very happy with this little mail pickup.